Minecraft can at times get boring and plain. To fix this, you want to install iris shaders. Shaders give a complete visual overhaul to the game, making it look more cinematic and realistic. But what are shaders? Simply put, shaders are a set of visual effects that transform your Minecraft world by enhancing its graphics, making things like water, sky, and lighting look incredibly lifelike. In a nutshell, they make your game look amazing. Hopefully I've convinced you that shaders are awesome, but with so many options, it can be difficult to know which shader to use. Here are my top picks. Astralex looks great, especially with the night sky, but it comes just short of rethinking voxels in terms of lighting. Rethinking voxels' lighting is really next level, and the graphics are incredible, but at the cost of FPS. In first place, I have Complementary Reimagined. It's similar to rethinking voxels, but it runs extremely well on most computers, so that's what I recommend. Now let's get those hands dirty and install some shaders. The first First and foremost, you're going to need a launcher. The default Minecraft launcher is terrible for modding your game, so I recommend you download a different Minecraft launcher. For this video, we're using At Launcher, but you can use a different one if you prefer. To learn more about what launchers I recommend, check out my video on launchers. First, go to the At Launcher download page and download the launcher. Open the downloaded file and go through the prompts until you are in the launcher. Go to the Accounts tab and get signed into your Microsoft account. Finally, you can go to the Packs tab and install the Additive Pack under Moderance. This pack is like Opti find but modern. You get a huge FPS boost plus some other small mods that improve the game. You also get Optifine features such as a zoom or most importantly shaders. Once installed click add mods and then change the drop down box from curseforge to moderate then the other drop down box from mods to shaders. Then choose complementary reimagined. You now have shaders. But what's great about complementary reimagined and shaders in general is that they are very flexible. Depending on your personal preference you can tweak the settings exactly how you like. Let's customize the water. Go to shaders then click settings. From here navigate to the water settings and choose fantasy or any other style you prefer. And now the water looks incredible. This is just one tweak you can make so make sure to experiment and find what works best for you. I personally leave it mostly default but fantasy style water is really great. We have successfully made everything from the simplest block to the vast horizons look drop dead gorgeous. So go on and give your Minecraft world the makeover it deserves. I hope this tutorial was helpful and covered exactly what you needed, but if not, feel free to leave a comment and I will respond. Like the video as it helps my small channel grow, and check out my latest video here. Finally, have fun and happy modding. Meow.